What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. So in today's video we're going to do a little bit of an experiment on this BMW using this stuff. So let's get started. Okay guys, so I've had this stuff for quite a while. Um, it's a magic head gasket repair kit in a fluid. I've got no idea it's made, it doesn't even say where it's made to be honest. Anyways guys, so you've seen this BMW F650 in previous videos and this bike has a blown head gasket. That's why we went a bit quiet on it. Um, I actually still have to order the parts, I forgot a little bit what's standing in the back. So to get started on this, I first need to drain the oil out of this bike and all the coolant as well because it did mix. That's how I know it's got a blown head gasket or the head could be cracked. Anyways guys, this say gasket magic, head gasket fix, overheating, water and oil, radiator bubbling, misfiring or exhaust vapors are signs of a blown head gasket. Simply put into radiator and save thousands on mechanical repair. <laughs> we'll see. This solution forms a non-corrosive adhesive bond to metal and aluminium. Seals most head gasket leaks in minutes for all petrol or diesel engines. Will not clock radiator or thermostat. So guys, this is obviously not a permanent fix. This is for if something does happen when you are out. Uh, let's say you're in Springbok for Pajero and your head gasket blows, who knows. So as you can see guys, we are currently stopped uh, pretty much, I don't know, about an hour out of camp uh, from last night. And there's a problem with Maddie. <laughs> Looks like our uh, head gasket's gone. Um, this, the temperature gauge started climbing and... Weird stuff happens in the middle of nowhere. Then you have this in your boot. Will this actually get you home? Let's see. So as you guys can see, that's a pretty nice mock trick there. Now to get the oil out of the frame. So I'm gonna fill up this engine with the ground engine flush and since a funnel is like a fringe and impact when you need it you can't find it i'm just going to try and use a tiktok hack where they use a screwdriver as a funnel for the old oil let's see if it works i'm not gonna lie it's easier just to throw it in Okay, for the next step, we're going to put half a bottle of this into the radiator and fill it up with water. So the guys that's curious, it's like a pink gluey liquid. It's quite interesting. Okay, so now they say we must start it and then let idle for 10 minutes. So I hope it actually starts and I've got a timer on my phone.
so we are eight minutes in and eventually the fan kicks on now you guys can see right there and you can hear it struggling a little bit i'm starting to think that the whole process inside the head gasket is happening at this moment so i've decided to go a little bit more than the 10 minutes because it does say that keep it going for 10 minutes on idle and then you have to take it on a ride for about 20-30 minutes so while doing instead of riding it i'm just gonna ref it very little and see if that works mixing and that's how after 10 minutes that start coming out I'm just gonna leave it I've got nothing to lose I want to rebuild that motor anyway well that was the first rift and it died I guess <laughs> that stuff did not work um, I mean the fan is still running let's see if it will start up again So that sound where it just stops, that is, I think, hydro lock. So I want to pull out the spark plug and quickly check if we get water out of that. So the spark plug is fouled. So let's crank it and see. I don't see any water coming out of it so did it work or did the water already evaporate oh yeah i've got the spark plug back in so let's see if it starts up now maybe Come on. one more try I think the battery is flat let me put it on charge quickly okay guys i think i know what my fault was i let idle on choke so it fouled the plugs could be that the fault plugs is just not making it run so the battery is like uh, it's almost full but i'm gonna give it a go anyways and see if it does start i did clean up the plugs put them back in so let's see that's a no and I don't think this stuff worked so I think that's gonna be a wrap for today's video and in the next video I'm gonna open up this engine and let's see what's actually going on inside of it so thank you all for watching hit the like button hit the subscribe button cheers